going to be an incredibly destructive hole controlled by a raccoon. Yeah, no, it's real. I know. It's crazy. Hello, everybody. I'm Kindly Keen, and welcome to Donut County. For those of you who have been around for a long time, you might know that I played this game a very long time ago. Actually, like four and a half years ago, September 4th, 2018, I played the first few levels of Donut County, and then I never came back to it. I figured it's time to go back to it. So let's go back to Donut County. And if you guys want to check out that first video, uh, it's crazy. That's like two houses ago. I'm in a completely different office area. I'm probably way less tired because I didn't have kids back then, which is crazy to think about. But either way, I'm happy to be back. I don't remember what was happening. I think that we like swallowed up. Oh yeah, okay, so this couple got eaten by the hole and everybody's like recounting their stories of how they got consumed by this hole. And we're currently 900 feet underground or something like that. I don't remember. And this, of course, is BK, the, the hero, the anti-hero. He's the raccoon that's causing all this chaos. This is extremely gross. You're gross. No, I'm not gross. You love trash. You love trash, too. Get him, BK. Everyone here loves trash. So true. Why else would you all make so much of it? Yeah, that's 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 fair. Are everyone's homes just trash to you? Yes. <laughs> wrong answer, BK. Wrong answer. Don't say that about my trailer. Yeah, don't mess with Pepper. Yeah. What happened to your trailer, Pepper? Something tells me we're about to find out. Well, after me and Salt split, I went to Joshua Tree Park for some peace and quiet. I brought my laptop also to watch bird videos. <laughs> okay. Sure. So now we're in Joshua Tree, we're deploying the hole, we're recounting the story of how Pepper got eaten by this hole. And, uh, this bird is throwing me hot coals. <gasps> okay, if I remember correctly, like, sometimes if you consume, like, like, uh, the fire and stuff, like, the hole actually gets those properties, right? Like, it gets the hot. I think in the, the level that we played before this, we made, like, popcorn. We, we got like a bunch of corn and then got fire and made popcorn in the hole. It was awesome. Oh, yeah, look at look. Okay, the hole is on fire. What does that mean? I don't really know. Oh my gosh, I am lighting stuff on fire now. Okay, that's what that means. I just lit the entire bench on fire. Sure, I'm just gonna keep eating stuff. Yum. And in case you didn't know, as I consume more stuff, the hole gets bigger. And then I can eat bigger stuff. And that is, of course, the goal, I think. Oh my gosh, I'm on fire again. I'm burning down trees. Wait. Oh, I understand. Okay, so if I put a coal in the into the hole, a coal in the hole, then it lights on fire because the, the coals are hot. Okay. Yeah, I get it. And now I'm burning down the trees to get their their leaves, I guess. And now I can eat the, the whole bench. And yeah, I need more fire. Thank you. And then I'm going to light this tree on fire. Also, I'm going to eat this dude's trailer because I think I'm big enough. <laughs> I am. All right. And uh, Mr. Crow, I'm sorry to do this to you, but you're next on the, on the list. No, you're not next on the list. What's happening? Oh, oh, we're, we're eating cars and entire boulders as as one does. This, this is way too much power for a for a psycho raccoon. Also, where did he get this app? Because I want to I want to download it. This seems like fun. And actually, it doesn't seem like fun. It seems incredibly dangerous for everyone, including me. Great delivery. I've delivered this guy to the center of the earth. And that is my job. What's the trashopedia? Oh. That's the Trashopedia. You can see all the trash that we've collected. Pepper's truck, a dumpster you can drive. That's not very nice. You have a garbage day too. All right, let's see who our next victim, I mean, uh, friend is. Uh, question here. You didn't save the Joshua trees because you were too busy looking at bird videos? Well, I, they're hundreds of years old, so old. I mean, he's the one who took out the Joshua trees. <laughs> 
And he's <laughs> he's shaming Pepper. He's gaslighting Pepper into thinking that it's Pepper's fault for not saving the trees. Anyways, you and your brother have issues, dude. Admit it. No, I I wasn't looking at bird stuff that time, okay? Then what were you doing, Pepper? I was writing an email to a bird? No, you trash sniffer to my brother, Salt. Excuse me? I was writing an apology. I shouldn't have smashed your lava lamp. So true. And I shouldn't have ate the lava. Also true. It was wrong of me. Pep, it's all right, dude. The lava is the best part. <laughs> I love these two. Salt and pepper, man. Aw, LOL. Dude, BK is heartless. These brothers reconciling with each other, it's such a beautiful moment, and all you can do is LOL. So, I've reunited feuding brothers, solved the civil servant snake problems, given a child the gift of flight. I'm a hero. <laughs> okay, yeah, you keep telling yourself that. Hey, you, hair guy. What? <laughs> Look at this dude. Also, he's got a cast. What's that from? What do you do? I sell explosives. <laughs> of course you do. Whoa, sweet. Don't give the raccoon explosives. He's already dangerous enough. I mean, that sounds unsafe, dude. Concerned citizens would probably want your fireworks stand blown up for safety. Oh no, I run my business completely above board. I have the most permits in Donut County. Playing with fireworks is safer than driving a car. <laughs> I wonder if, I don't think that's true. Either way, his firework hut is um, definitely gonna get blown up. Like one million percent. Okay, I do love this. He's got like a little arm hanging off the side that launches little fireworks. Oh, it scared the birds. Oh, wait, can I? Okay, okay, now I have fireworks in the hole. Now, what exactly does that mean? I think if we can somehow get fire in the hole, then we can have lit fireworks in the hole, which then become fireworks launching out of the hole, which, oh, yeah. Let's make that happen. How do I do that? Do I just keep consuming these fireworks? I feel like I need to, oh, you know what? What if? What? Okay, wait, wait for the firework to get lit and then eat it. Yes. Anytime now. I I insist. You can. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then you yeah, eat it and then we scare the birds. Check this out. <laughs> I knew it. And now I eat the birds. I'm so sorry, birds. Actually, I'm not sorry. I'm really channeling my inner evil raccoon right now. Oh, look at this nice little bird having a nice lunch right above this firework hut. That doesn't seem like a good idea. I'm gonna shoot a firework at you. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna set my hole right there. What do you think of that? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it's gonna fall. Oh, you need another firework? Yeah, you do. I've decided that you need another firework. Just gonna launch that bad boy right there. How, what do you think of that? Pretty cool, right? Okay, one more, if you insist. Let's go. Yeah, that's gonna, yeah. <laughs> that's gonna ruin her day. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. I'm gonna eat your lunch now. Oh, I just ate corn. <gasps> popcorn time? Is it popcorn time? I, I think it's popcorn time. It is indeed popcorn time. <laughs> it's happening. Oh man, it's so good. This is a very large popcorn, by the way. I don't know how these people are growing their corn, but it's impressive. And I think that's gonna be the end of this level. Oh no, it's not, cause you gotta get all the fireworks going. How are you enjoying that nap? Yeah, I don't think it's gonna last. Okay, I mean, or it will. I thought he would definitely wake up from fireworks. No, that guy is heavy sleeper. 99% of seagulls are criminals. Fact. Little thieves. All right, so that's the story of how hair guy ended up in this hole. Boom. I was just cleaning up the neighborhood. Who else has a gripe with me? <laughs> it's like, bring it on. Uh, I do. Well, my gripe is actually with Mira. 
Now you're in for it, Mira. Coco? Well, Mira knows the details, but I figure everyone should hear. Even the bird weirdos? Yes. Tell them. This sounds serious. I... I knew the raccoons were making the holes. I knew the whole time. <gasps> Everyone gasps. Oh, all right, Coco. Coco the crocodile. He's about to get eaten by a hole. How many snakes would it take to defeat you? Send him a quack. What do you think of that? And that. And that, yeah. Now we're talking. This is a serious conversation, okay. Uh, big snakes? Venomous? Normal size. Okay. Go on. But you gotta fight in a tiny room. Oh, that changes everything. Four. Okay. Hmm. Probably 1,000 snakes. <laughs> Alright, that's a few more than I was expecting, but... Okay, expect a shipment soon. Are, are you gonna send a thousand snakes to him? You haven't looked into the disappearances yet? Have you? Uh, it's taking a long time for her to reply. No. Salt hasn't answered his phone in days. Did you talk to Possum? He said he has info. Possum told me that the earth is hollow. And flat. At the same time. Somehow. Yeah, that makes no sense. Mira, you know ever since those raccoons moved in, folks have been disappearing. And you work at their donut shop. I don't think it's a donut shop. I think it's a shop of horrors. IDK, the raccoons treat me really well. And BK is my friend. I ordered a donut. Why? <laughs> so the donut is the hole, I, I think, is, is how I'm understanding this, although it's still very confusing and weird and delightful. She, yeah, okay, so she knows that because he ordered a donut, he's about to get eaten. That's why she's like, I gotta go, bye. And he's just gonna go back to sleep. He, man, he can sleep through anything. Whoa, we got geckos. And they can turn invisible. I see you guys. I see you. I see those little eyes. It's kind of creepy, honestly. Can I eat the green guys? Yes, I can. Get over here. Get over here. Stop running. You, you're you a little too big, I think. Yeah, you're you're still a little too big, but this little guy can get. And, and there's an even littler guy. There he goes. Okay, now I should be able to eat you guys. The bigger boys. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Goodbye. One more. Get him. Get him. Yeah. Hungry donut. Oh, I see more eyeballs. I see you guys. Don't think you're hiding from me. You think you're so sneaky. Nah, no chance. All right, sorry to eat your books and your lovely fan and these flamingos. Can I eat the sprinkler? Of course I can. Why wouldn't I be able to eat a sprinkler? Guess I'm gonna eat the music. Is the music gonna go away? Yep, the music went away when I ate it. Of course it did. It seems like that type of game. All right, let's eat some of these plants around here. Do you think I can get this? Kind of just tip it over? Yeah, <laughs> there you go. And our next victim right here. Whoop, see ya. And since we're here, we might as well finish the job. Get his whole house. Oh, okay, there goes the tree. I was not expecting it to break apart in pieces like that. This is a lovely patio, I guess. It looks a little dangerous, probably not to code. I'm gonna eat it, just for your safety. And then, it, it looked like he's, he's living in a can. My guy's living in a can? Maybe I'm doing you a favor. I think I remember, so this rank is basically what's driving BK to keep eating things because this app has like an XP system in it and he wants to get to rank 10 to get this, which I think is like a, a drone or something. So he's eating everything in this city, basically completely destroying all of Donut County for a drone. Totally, totally worth it. So sorry, Coco. It was my fault you got put in the hole. I should never have taken the job with the raccoons. What the? I thought we were friends, dude. I thought we were too. It's getting serious now. But then you ruined my town. Ugh. I don't get it. I tried to help when you asked me to. I bought the catapult upgrade for you, even though it's a waste of points. You told me that with the catapult, you could launch everyone back out of the hole. Yet here we are, in the hole. Chickens are not a waste of points. Fair? Kiss Dollop on the head. You offended her. <laughs> Buck, 
Uh, no. Kiss her! Oh my gosh, Jelly Bean. Getting aggressive, dollop. Fuck! I guess that's what chickens sound like in this world. No! It's the least you can do after stealing all of our eggs. I didn't steal the eggs, they fell through the ground. Fuck! <laughs> Just tell your story, Jelly Bean. Times were tough on the farm. Here we go. I had to sell my prized rooster to make ends meet. Dollop was very upset. Welcome to egg farm. Chicken barn, okay. Oh wait, BK is actually there in person? What are you doing? You're gonna... Is this how BK got eaten by the hole? Okay, so this is also going to tell the story of how he fell into the hole. Oh wait, no, that's a different raccoon. Was, what does this do? I pulled some kind of lever. I don't know if it does anything. At least it doesn't do anything right now, as far as I can tell. Let's knock down some of this stuff so that I can get my hole growing. There we go. There we go. Eat the motorcycle. And the raccoon. Thanks. There you go. Oh. Cut to BK sitting on the toilet. Why did you deliver a donut to Coco? He ordered one? LOL, what's the problem? BK, this is too much. I like how she fixed her grammatical error. You have to buy the catapult upgrade right now and fix things. But I gotta save up for my quadcopter. Do it, you promised. Fine, fine. I'll fix everything. But you owe me. Bye. Okay, so we're going into the store for this app to spend our points on a catapult. Could I also buy energy drinks? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna buy some energy drinks. I got some extra. I just got an achievement called Gamer. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's buy the catapult. Bye. Done. Okay, so now, oh, oh, what? Left click to catapult? Okay, I gotta see how this thing works. So we can launch whatever we ate last? Or just launch certain objects? I don't know, but that broke the chicken cage, which I think is good. Oh no, I see, okay, in the upper left-hand corner, we have a chicken loaded, <laughs> locked and loaded. Maybe if I shoot at this bell? No, that's not the play. Oh, interesting. Okay, so the chicken kind of floats once you launch him in the air. Oh, dude, what if... Okay, okay, I have a plan. I launch you up in the air, and then I pull this thing down? <gasps> I don't know what this is gonna do, but it felt like the right thing to do. It did... It, I, I get an egg. You're launching eggs out of this thing now. I gotta catch it. I gotta catch you. Yes! Okay, and then maybe I can hit the switch. Yeah! <laughs> this is awesome. Okay. All right. Oh, that's a lot of eggs. Eat them all. Uh, you're missing! It's kind of hard to, to line it up. I gotta make sure that I'm catching the eggs. Come on. Don't miss. Look at the hole. It grows. It grows in power. It's so hungry. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of eggs. Okay, I'm full. Can I eat you? Just kidding, I'm not full. I would like to consume everything on the map now. Oh dang, that's a big hole. Yeah, let's just eat the entire giant chicken. And of course, I mean, we're gonna eat the barn. Goes without saying, but let's eat the smaller barn first. And now let's eat the barn. <gasps> Can I eat the orchard behind? Oh, that would be so satisfying. I mean, that was still awesome, but imagine just like tearing down hundreds of trees. <laughs> that would be pretty sweet. All right, so that's the story of how the bunch of chickens got eaten. Bach, you weren't even trying to help, BK. I was trying. It's hard to use the catapult. He was not trying. I think the hole is only really good for destroying things. It must be designed that way. Designed? Don't look at me. I didn't design it. But you used it. Well, what else could I use? I don't know, you could have used real donuts. Yeah, that seems fair. I think when people order donuts, they do not expect to get eaten by a ground hole. They expect edible, delicious, fried, doughy treats that happen to be round and have holes in the middle. Could a real donut have saved poor Bearclaw from certain doom? Saved me? 
You humiliated me. You were getting hunted by bees. I'm a hero. You ordered a donut to the middle of the forest? Yep, he really likes donuts. I guess it's suspicious that you'd offer to deliver donuts all the way out to the middle of the forest. Hunted by bees? Look, look, look. It's a tough job. Sometimes you get hunted by bees. Okay, we're gonna see what happened to the beekeeper. <laughs> this, this is gonna be nuts. Uh, yeah, he, he does look like he's kind of having a bad day. Welcome to Honey Nut National Forest. Let's get in there. Sending out the donut. Let's, uh, let's just eat some stuff. Uh, can we eat this honey? Mmm, delicious. Eat some pine cones. I do see there's like something dripping. What? What's going on here? Can I, can I catch this? No? Okay. And then the frog. Something's going on with that frog. Something sus with that frog. I don't know. Oh, oh, I can catapult. Okay. So maybe I can shoot this at the, the frog? No, that did not work. Okay. Maybe if I like, huh. Oh, ho, ho. froggy like honeycomb. All right. Oh, that's what was dripping. They were uh, beehives. Can I shoot the frog at the beehives? Will the frog just eat the beehive? Yes. Yes, he will. He loves him some honey. Get it. I'm a little concerned about these bees, though. If I shoot the frog at the bee, are they going to sting him? Nope. He's just going to eat them. Okay. That's awesome. Give me that beehive. And then give me that bee. Yum. So I think I'm big enough to eat this stump. Can I eat the bigger stump yet? Yes. There we go. And now we can eat the entire beehives. Awesome. <laughs> Next stage, please. All right. I see a lot of bees. Um, let's use the frog. See, so BK's not such a bad guy. He's See, he's saving uh, whatever this dude's name was. That frog is getting fat. What? You see this thing? Dang, that's a big boy. Okay, so I don't know if we're feeding the hole or we're just feeding the frog. <laughs> can I eat this barn yet? No, but I can probably pull you down, right? Uh, there we go. And now we can eat the barn. Getting close to rank 10. Getting very close. Chef. What about me? Nobody asked about me. Did BK own you with a catapult too? No. Mm-hmm. He ruined my restaurant. Your restaurant stinks. It's not very nice. LOL. Yeah, it's grade D. Yikes. How can you guys be called salt and pepper and not have an appreciation for soup? Boo. Calm down, nerds. What did BK do to your restaurant? Well, I was dealing with a slight bug problem. I was exhausted from rounding up bugs, so I ordered a donut, as one does. Cat Soup. What a name for a restaurant. Yeah. Ooh, honey, it's date night. You want to go to Cat Soup? Oh. <laughs> we got these cockroaches that we got to eat up. I love that he caught them in these, like, little basket carton things. And now he's just sitting on top of them. Those are some big cockroaches, to be fair. I could understand why you'd be a little scared of them. Also, I'm about to eat you. You're welcome. Hey, at least you don't have to worry about the cockroaches. Although, I just brought you and the cockroaches down. So, I, maybe you do have to worry about them. All right, we're inside of the kitchen. Oh, oh we're making soup? What? Oh! <gasps> I am now a hole full of soup. Do I have to, I have to season it? Okay, okay, season it with a little pepper. How do I? Okay, yeah. No, don't eat my soup. Get away, get, get away. Get. I, I'm thinking that I need to feed this soup to the to the bird. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try. He's gonna like that, right? Oh, he likes it, I think. There's a lot of cockroaches here. My guy was like, not even trying to stop the cockroaches. He's, he stopped like two of them. There was like 20. You need to get a professional, an exterminator. I guess I'm the exterminator. I'm gonna eat some, some cars. <laughs> this whole city is gonna get eaten. The whole thing, everything. Oh, there's a trash can back there, yum. Oh, I can eat these platforms, nice. 
And now I should be able to eat these bunkers, I think. Yup. Yup. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then I can eat the whole dang restaurant. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We're taking down entire s skyscrapers. I don't know if I call them skyscrapers, but they're big buildings and we're eating them and we're probably going to eat this, this highway. No, that would have been sweet. Ah! You unlocked the quadcopter report to raccoon HQ for training. Holy cow. This is the day we've been waiting for, for four and a half years. All right, let's see where this story goes. I got food poisoning from cat soup. That's, yeah, yeah, that's unsurprising. More than once. Yeah, I used to work there. It's pretty gross. <laughs> Sounds like a great place. <laughs> wow, everything I do seems to have helped everyone. He's got a point, Mira. Maybe BK ain't so bad. Okay, everybody, we all know cat soup was a hole, even before it got hold. <laughs> but let's get back to the real problem here. Yeah, my 100% smashed quadcopter. Yeah, why did you smash it, Mira? Dude, I didn't want to smash it. I had to. Interesting. Okay. So we're back to the donut shop where it all began. Oh, I'm, I'm not controlling this. This is all BK, I think. Like, I can't control it, right? No, I can't control it. Okay. I mean, it's pretty cool, honestly. Check this out. That was pretty cool. Wow. Oh, yeah. And this... Wow. Notice how the propellers spin really fast. That's how it flies. Genius. No kidding. And it only took 12 deliveries for me to get it. Can I see? Sure. Oh. Be careful. Careful? Like this? She's gonna smash it. A little lower. Hmm. How about this? Oh, no. Oh! That does kind of hurt. What are you doing? You're acting psycho. How can you brag about this stupid toy when you got it by destroying our friends' homes? They ordered the donuts, dude. I give people what they want. This is pointless. BK, what's your password for this thing? Uh, I think it's 0451. Wait, no, I changed it to Bonky Kong. <laughs> Thanks. By the way... Do you know what's at the bottom of the holes? I don't know. What are you doing? Teaching you a lesson. This is how BK and Mira end up in the hole. She is now in control of the hole and yeah, we all see what's, what's about to happen. So now we need to get big enough to swallow up BK who is cowering on top of that car. Just eat some cactus. We got some bricks over here to chew up, yum. Ooh, that's okay. We can eat the bigger cactus now. Oh, and the whole tree and the walkway. All right. See you, BK. All right. But why did Mira swallow herself in the hole? I guess maybe she felt like she had to see what was down there with BK, I suppose. I don't know. But she's about to go down. That's for sure. Can I get that donut? There you go. It was like perfectly donut shaped. Hey, and I just got an achievement called Donut County. That's not the end of the game, is it? We got to be getting close, but I don't think this is the end. I had to do it, dude. There was no other way to get through to you. You don't know what it's like to lose something you care about. I mean, I guess I get what you mean. You guys love your weird trash houses and took them away by doing my job, which I guess in this context is an evil job. BK will never learn. <laughs> Close enough. Will you help us get everyone out of the hole now? Blah, okay, fine. Where do we start? I was hoping you'd know. I'm sorry if I gave you the impression that I know stuff, but I know basically nothing. Definitely something I would say. You've got to find Pup. If you guys can find Pup, we can use his hot air balloon to get back to the surface. Okay, so this is from like a previous uh, level where I think it's it's this guy's or this lady's son or, or grandson. He was in a hot air balloon and then we launched him into the sky. 
by heating up the hot air balloon and then he flew away. So now we gotta go save him. Tablet, please locate GPS data for hot air balloon containing a pup. Man, this technology's getting crazy. I'm kidding, this thing doesn't have voice commands. Okay, yeah, great. Possum, possum is gonna help us find pup. He's weird though. Where is he? If you know where he lives, I can get him. Yeah, just deliver a donut to the abandoned house. Of course, possum squats in the abandoned house. I always thought it was haunted. Oh, this is possum, huh? Okay, yeah, he seems pretty weird. Not gonna lie. 